guys! Welcome to the first day of summer soaps! I'm so excited. However, very skeptical and worried about the fragrance. Because A, I've never used it before. And B, it's not from Nature's Garden. It comes from Craft Crafter's Choice. It's, oh that's the wrong one. Where'd it go? Where did I put, I don't know where I put it. It's called Sea Mist and something or another. It'll be in the description box below. It did good, get um, decent reviews. And I'm using my Hathor recipe because, you know, I'm worried about the fragrance. I want to do a tiger stripe. So we'll see how that works out. I did buy enough to do two batches in case this one goes to heck in a handbasket. And, you know, we can just use this for personal use or I'll send it out to Renee and donate it or whatever and then figure out another design. But for now, we're going to mix this up. My yogurt and my heavy cream are in here. My lye water has lye lint in it. Um, hold on a second. I'm going to take a my stick blender to my lye. There's... I'm going to break up some of that lye lint. Okay. There we go. Yeah, there was... I didn't want to... Oop, you guys can't even see that, can you? I didn't want to... Actually, I get up and get my strainer. There's salt stuck to the sides, too. Gotta love it, right? Okay, so I am going to get... I'm going to scrape the heck out of this and get this all mixed up and uh, bring, you, bring you back for the colors. I just had my one of my empty bottles fall down there. Okay, now this is barely emulsified. So I'll have to, of course, stick blend everything. Um, one of the main colors is white anyway. The soap, the soap? Yeah, the soap is in, no, the song that this soap is inspired by is Surfing in the USA by the Beach Boys. And I want to make this look like a beach ball. <laughs> yep, a beach ball. So my colors are the our three primary colors are blue, yellow, and red. And it's going to be white. So I want to do the tiger stripe where it's, you know, white, red, white, you know, blue, white, yellow, white, red, you know that kind of thing. So I want it to, you know, have that, that striped thing of a beach ball. So I'm going to need, of course, more white than anything else. And I really hope I didn't put too much water in that. So let's see, these three need to have the same amount in them. And then, whoop! Yeah, we're losing our, our cups here, guys. It's a good thing it's mixed with oil in that water, right? Okay. Our blue. Our yellow. And our red. Oh. We need some more in our yellow. And I'll scrape the rest off into the blue. I'm excited about this one. It's definitely, it, it's more of a spa scent than it is a beach scent, but it did fit the song because it is a very, like, how, how do I describe it? It's, it's a fragrance that makes you happy for sure. And the first time I smelled it, literally this is the song I thought of, which is so strange. You know, you would usually associate something like, I don't know, <laughs> really beachy with a Beach Boys song, more tropical-y, but okay, so let me get this white done. Well, actually, I'm going to mix all the colors and we'll come back. Let me get Judy out of here because I don't need her anymore. Well, I don't know. I may need her. It might brace. I don't know. I do not know yet. Oh, that's got red everywhere. Okay. So, I like... Like I said, I'm going to hand stir the fragrance in, and hopefully this doesn't go haywire. Um, the batter is very fluid right now, even with, you know, the quick stick blend. 
I'm also going to um, wipe off my stick blender just in case it rices because I will have to, you know, stick blend it from lightest to darkest again in case it rices. So. Well, I guess I could have put a little bit more blue in there. I didn't stir that red. I just set it aside, didn't I? Oh, no, I guess I, I stirred it a little bit. Anyway, let me wipe off my stick blender. Judy needs a good wipe down. Even though this red on her looks beautiful. Judy Garland always looked beautiful in red lipstick. For those of you who are new, yes, I named my appliances after people. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to bring my mold in. Um, I'm going to angle you guys down. Boy, I'm stepping on my cord. Angle you guys down just a, a titch and bring you in closer. I'll move the mold. That'll work, right? Yeah, that'll work. Okay, so I'm gonna start. I think I wanna do red, blue, yellow, and then white, which actually means I need to, I'm a, oh, uh, yeah, I need to put it in all of them, don't I? Dang it, I almost forgot the fragrance, you guys. Okay, so a little bit, a little bit, a little bit, and then the rest of it. Well, it's not right there on the surface of the soap. Definitely not racing on the surface of the soap. My TD is much thicker than the rest of my batter. Um, I don't know, a lot of TD in there, y'all. I hope I don't get glycerin rivers. I think I may have put too much water in there. Alright, so let's try this little tiger stripe here. Oh, I'm bringing this way. Okay, so spatula's out. One, two. So I will definitely be leaving a positive review so far <laughs> on the Wholesale Supplies website. Okay, so, oop. That was not a stripe. That was like a a uh, base. I got to get that out of there. That's going to mess me up, y'all. But I need to lay it each time I lay a color. I'm hoping that this does not turn brown. I mean, this is all the primary colors. So, and all the primary colors together make <gasps> brown. Oh, wait. See, this is going to mess me up, y'all. This soap might be a complete freaking disaster. starting to thicken up so which is good because then my lines will be more distinct I probably should have waited a little bit longer before I did my first pour however oh yeah see it's really starting to thicken up now and it looks like there's some racing how did that happen there wasn't any racing when I started My yellow is still pretty good. Red. White. Blue. Yeah, there's some racing in this blue. Oh, wait. I missed a little bit right 
there. Whoop. Well, that piece is going to have a little blue in it. White. Yellow. Are y'all even still watching me? <laughs> oh. Okay. White. I'm going to bang this really quick after I do this next go around because I may have to do something different with the top because I have more color. I knew I should have done more, whoop, more white, but I did not. So I'm going to have to do something a little bit different with the top. I'll be able to do one more pass of each color with the white, but then we'll be done. My hands are a mess, y'all. And my counter. And... Oh, white. Oh, jeez. I definitely should have made more white. But this should be the last pass of white that I have to do. Actually, I could probably do one more. Like on the top of the yellow. You know what? I'm going to bang it right now. Just gives me a little bit more room to drop this in there. And then I'm going to do the rest of the white. I probably don't have enough to go all the way across, but I'm going to try. And if not, whatever. I just don't want to waste any soap. I'm not a soap waster. That and if I don't scrape, I feel like I failed in my whole soaping night. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to stop scraping now. I just wish I had more white. I should have. It was that heavy pour at the beginning. I, you know, mine is all over the place. I mentioned last week that I needed to talk to y'all, you know, or just being, you know, making soap, get my mind off of family drama, and, you know, <laughs> this is being made the same night as that, so I'm a little distracted. Okay, so I think what I'm going to do sorry, other than bang it, is I'm going to lay the three primary colors along, you know, on a line on the top. So I'm going to start with the red. I'm sorry, I was being quiet, you guys, because I was concentrating. I should probably put the yellow in the middle. Yeah, I'm going to put the yellow in the middle. Because we're going to get a few interesting colors by doing it this way. Because once I bang it, you know, that those are going to be flat and touching. Okay, and the blue.
Okay, look at that, guys. Let me clean this off. Just a little bit. Okay, let me get a skewer. And we're going to go back and forth and back and forth and back and forth. That's all we're going to do. Very lightly in the soap. Yeah, that definitely needs a little bit more color. Oh, there we go. Let me stick. Let me play with that. Oh, look at that. Oh, I like that. Okay. Bang it again. That's not the bottle I want. Oop. Gluing this bottle didn't help, you guys. There we go. 18 to 24 hours. And uh, we'll cut that baby open. So thanks for staying with me. I'll see y'all later. Bye-bye. Hi, guys. Welcome back. We are going to cut Serpent in the USA. Oh, I do need... Oh, that's my knife. I don't want my knife. I'm going to take my potato peeler to this really quick. I'm not worried about the the front and the you know this edge or the back edge because I'm gonna take end pieces off. Let's see if this turned out. Here he is. <gasps> it did. At least so far, so good. Oh my goodness. I'm excited. Oh, sticky. Oh, I'm so excited. This is so cool. I am so excited. I was so looking forward to having the beach ball look, but I wasn't sure if it was actually going to happen. And it did. Yay. Oh, yay. I am so happy. This is what I wanted, y'all. Although, it just not as much white on the bottom. I over poured that white on the bottom. But, I am certainly not disappointed. Certainly not. I almost just pulled that piece away and, like, put it on a tray. That's so funny. This really did come through the cure the scent did really really nice um it like i can't explain it to you it, it's sort of like the because it has some floral notes floral notes in it um i will post the description of the fragrance down below but it's like those opened up and i can smell those now with like the ocean type smell so it's really good I like it I really like it and this isn't my first Beach Boys song that y'all are going to see me do for the summer <laughs> one of our solstice soaps that you have never seen me make that needs to be made um, let me cut this in half that needs to be made is also a Beach Boys song and I'm not going to make I, I'm not going to make you guys watch Margaritaville again you guys have seen me make that I think three times three times so and of course I'll plane that side but that's it but yeah I'm not gonna make you guys watch Margaritaville this year <laughs> so you guys have seen me make it a few times but I will make the two other solstice soaps that uh, 
you have not seen me make before. And uh, next week, um, we're taking, I know I said that this week would be the start of the summer stuff, but I have one more batch um, out of the 15 batches that I had previously measured out already. I have one more to do, and that will be next week, and then you'll see all the summer stuff. So I will see you guys later. Bye-bye.